Understanding Partial Migration, a Comprehensive Guide. Hello everyone, and welcome to today's video. We're going to explore a fascinating concept called partial migration. This phrase might sound a bit technical, but don't worry, we'll break it down together. Whether you're learning English or just curious about this term, you're in the right place. So let's dive in and unravel the mystery of partial migration. Partial migration is a term that might sound complex at first, but it's actually quite straightforward. It refers to a situation where only a part of a population migrates or moves from one place to another, while the rest stays put. This phenomenon is often observed in the animal kingdom, where some species display this behavior based on environmental factors, resources, or individual characteristics. However, this concept can also apply to human populations in certain contexts. Understanding this term helps us appreciate the diversity and complexity of migration patterns. To really grasp partial migration, let's look at some examples in nature. Birds are a classic example. In some bird species, only a portion of the population migrates south for the winter, while others remain in their original habitat. This can depend on factors like age, health, and environmental conditions. For instance, younger birds might migrate more often than older ones. This selective migration ensures the survival and adaptation of the species in changing environments. While partial migration is commonly seen in animals, it can also be applied to human scenarios. For example, in a community or family, some members might move to another city or country for better job opportunities or education, while others stay behind. This selective movement can be influenced by factors like economic status, personal preferences, or family responsibilities. Understanding this concept helps us recognize the varied reasons behind migration and the impact it has on communities and individuals. The concept of partial migration is not just an interesting fact. It has significant implications. In ecology, it helps scientists understand animal behavior and ecosystem dynamics. In sociology and human geography, it provides insights into human migration patterns and their effects on societies. Recognizing the partial nature of migration allows for more nuanced discussions and policies related to migration, conservation, and social dynamics. And that wraps up our journey into understanding partial migration. I hope this video has shed light on this intriguing concept and made it easier for you to grasp. Whether in the animal kingdom or human societies, partial migration is a testament to the diverse ways in which living beings adapt to their environments. Thank you for watching, and I hope you found this video informative and engaging. Keep exploring, keep learning, and see you in the next video.